I can see the ground, so I pull my parachute, hoping to get to the ground first. But it seems someone beat me to it. People will know that it's a scramble to get a gun first, so I decide to bug out and head to another building. I go to the roof to put some distance between me and the enemy player and hopefully find a gun. A shotgun. It's better than nothing. So now I can relax, knowing I have something to defend myself with. I pick up some more supplies to help me to survive and then head back into the building. I have no idea that the bandit is already pushing on me. I can hear his footsteps, but I'm not equipped for this battle. I can only hope to wait it out, or maybe ambush him should he enter this bathroom. I can hear him getting closer and closer. But then the footsteps start to disappear. I decide to come out of the bathroom and see where he's gone. Maybe this bandit is also ill-equipped for a fight. So I'm gonna follow and try to engage. I can hear his footsteps, and he would have heard mine. There's no going back now. This guy had some okay loot, but nowhere near enough to survive. With more shots nearby, I decide to head out of the city and head for the forest. There's an eerie stillness in this forest. It's almost as if the apocalypse never happened. But I need to stay focused. This is how Barker and Delta got killed. I can't let that happen to me. I can hear something ahead. Maybe I can pick one off and steal his loot. Damn, I'm out of bounds but this jeep could get me out of trouble. I just hope there's enough fuel. I hear a ricochet on the jeep. This is dangerous, but then I see red smoke in the distance. It's a supply drop. This could help me survive. Seems like it was already taken by a bandit, so I need to get the hell out of here. I see a building on my right. That could be a good place to camp. I'm right in the middle of the zone, so I start making my way towards it. First, I need to make sure the building is safe, so I head up the stairs. Seems like I'm safe for now, 
but I know there are bandits nearby. And I've just spotted one. I want to remain invisible, but I cannot let this guy go. I have to kill him. I panic fired. I think I hit him once, but now everyone knows where I am. I hear a sniper shot fly past me. I need to find that sniper. I start scanning the windows. He takes another shot and reveals his position. I return fire. He's disappeared from my view. I can only assume that I hit him and now he's trying to heal. He takes another peek to take a few more shots at me, but I counter snipe him. We both shoot and I hit him in the helmet and he catches me straight in the chest of my body armor. I took a round to the chest and I'm bleeding, so I need to bandage and take some painkillers. Hopefully this will keep me going. The zone is closing in and I know the bandit has no choice but to move towards me. He's injured and doing his best to avoid my shots. The bandit took a round straight through the chest. He's not getting up. But I've made a lot of noise here. I'm sure there are other bandits close by and I've spotted another. Another kill and my body is full of adrenaline. My heart is pounding. I slowly reload my mag and take a pause. And in the corner of my eye, I see movement. I take aim and I fire. One shot straight to the neck and he goes down. Another player saw me. A split second later, and that would have been me. I need to get out of here. The zone is coming in. There's only three players left, including me. And I found the first one. I'm sure he's injured, but I can't be sure. I scan the windows. He takes one peek. Good night. There's one bandit left. I can't see anything and I can't hear anything. I have no idea where this last bandit is hiding. He's in the room next to me and has been for the past five to 10 minutes camping in the corner. He's using a technique to slowly move forward without making any sounds, and I have no idea. 
but the zone comes in, so he has to make his move. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. If you like this video, please head over to my Twitch channel. Uh, I'm online gaming almost every night now, so you can join me and follow all my adventures over on twitch.tv slash hidden underscore hedgehog. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you all in the next story. Stay hidden.